I'm Chris and Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science, science you can do right at home. I'm getting ready to ride the tilt and hurl and going over today's science file. And today's science file says... What causes motion sickness and how do you prevent it? Well, that's a great question. Try this. You will need an egg and a bowl. Okay, you are going to head to your kitchen where you're going to get yourself an No, 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 I don't mean frog eggs or reptile eggs or even an egg. I'm talking about a chicken egg. Oh, by the way, don't tell any jokes around eggs because they crack up. Oh, by the way, you need to be super careful with your egg because they... Oh. Well, that's one egg that's not going to college. Clean up on mile five! Okay, you're gonna get yourself a raw egg like this. You're gonna give it a spin, stop it, and then quickly let it go. Ah, uh, like this. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> now that's pretty wicked cool! It's spun! Oh, by the way, it really is raw. Here, let me show you. Haha! <laughs> well, that's pretty wicked cool. It continued to spin even after the bowl stopped. So, what does this have to do with motion sickness and... How do you care? Well, don't look at me. Take a closer look. Uh, at this. Motion sickness happens when your body is put through unnatural, unbalancing, or rough motion, as well as conflicting information from other sensory organs sent to the brain. Inside our ears are canals that are filled with a fluid that help us to keep our balance. And just like when we stopped the spinning egg and it kept spinning because of the fluid inside, when a theme park ride comes to an end, the fluid in your ears continues to move even though your body has stopped, and this is what makes you feel dizzy. To prevent motion sickness on amusement park rides, chew ginger gum or sip ginger drinks throughout the day and avoid rides with fast, multiple, repeating motions. Travel sickness in cars, ships, airplanes, as well as spacecraft is caused by your brain being sent information that you are moving but your eyes see a stationary object. This message is interpreted as a hallucination caused by ingesting a poison. In mild cases, you may get an upset stomach, but severe cases can cause dizziness, loss of balance, and yes, even cause vomiting. To cure mild cases of car and seasickness, look at the horizon. To cure mild air sickness, sit near the wing in a window seat and look out the window and watch the moving clouds, or try to get some sleep. Studying motion sickness in space is important to scientists so they can figure out ways to stop it from happening to future space tourists. So now you know more about motion 